This video is an overview on how to remove the front power seat from a 1995 to 1998 Porsche 911 Carrera. Remember to work safe and work smart. Work in a well-ventilated area, protect yourself from injury at all times, and attempt all work at your own risk. Before you begin, consult your owner's manual or the appropriate repair manual for your vehicle. For this power seat removal procedure, we used a 1997 Porsche 911 Carrera Cabriolet. Seat removal is often carried out to replace seat drive cables, seat drive motors, or to replace the seat covers. To help with this procedure, we used hand and eye protection, a 6mm Allen hex socket and drive ratchet for removing the seat anchor bolts, a 13mm open end wrench to disconnect the negative battery cable and a non-conductive cloth to cover the negative battery post, a fender cover to protect the door sill when removing and replacing the seat, and a torque wrench for tightening the seat anchor bolts during installation. It is a good idea to have wire ties on hand should you cut any during seat removal and a camera or camera phone to take pictures of their position. Since we will be disconnecting the battery, be sure to have your anti-theft radio code on hand. You may also need a Porsche scan tool to retrieve fault codes if any are present before disconnecting the battery. Note that this procedure assumes that the power seat is properly functioning. Begin by moving the seat to the fully forward position at the seat adjustment switch. This will reveal the rear seat anchor bolts. If necessary, raise the seat bottom to improve access to the rear anchor bolts. Using a 6mm Allen hex socket and drive ratchet, remove the anchor bolts at the rear of the seat rails. There are two bolts on each side. Remove all four bolts together with the bolt washers. Next, move the seat all the way back to reveal the front seat anchor bolts. Using the same socket and ratchet, remove the anchor bolt at the front of the seat rail. Remove the remaining anchor bolt at the opposite seat rail. Next, disconnect the battery. Unclip and pull back the trunk carpet. Caution! Disconnecting the battery may erase fault codes stored in the control module memory. Be sure to retrieve and record fault codes using a Porsche scan tool prior to disconnecting the battery. Using a 13mm open-end wrench, Loosen the negative battery cable and disconnect it from the battery. Cover the negative battery post with an insulating material to keep the cable from accidentally contacting the post. Carefully tilt the seat back to access the power seat harness connectors beneath the seat. First, remove the large 8-pin connector from the mounting bracket by sliding it to the center of the bracket and pushing it up and out. Cut wire ties if necessary to improve access to the connectors. On our seat, we did not need to cut away wire ties to access the wire harnesses. If you need to cut away ties, it is a good idea to take a cell phone picture of the wire tie locations prior to cutting them away so they can be reinstalled in the same locations. On this car, there are only two connectors that need to be disconnected, as indicated by the arrows. Note that the number of connectors and connector locations may vary based on the installed options. Disconnect the seat belt harness connector. Pull apart the 8 pin connector.
check for any remaining connectors and separate them as necessary. Finally, remove the seat from the vehicle, being careful not to scratch the painted surfaces or the door sill plate. It is a good idea to protect the painted sill when lifting the seat out of the vehicle. Installation of the front power seat is the reverse of removal. Be sure to tighten the bolts to the specified torque. If questions or difficulties arise, consult a Porsche repair specialist to be sure that the seat has been installed properly and safely. Feedback or questions? Visit our online tech forums or our online technical library at bentleypublishers.com.